a family mystery involving a president has finally been solved. A DNA test proves that a man here from Oregon and his brothers are the grandsons of Warren G. Harding, the 29th president. Our Jennifer Dowling digging deeper with more on the story of the president's mistress and how his heirs have proven they have presidential blood. What a great story, Jennifer. It's very interesting, Jeff. Jim Blessing's grandmother had long insisted before she died that she had Harding's only child, but her claims were rejected by the president's wife and many members of that family. Now he says he's happy to finally clear her name. This is what I wanted. I want the truth out there. For Jim Blessing, there was never a question just who was telling the truth. We knew the answer. My family's always known that it was. His grandmother, Nan Britton, long insisted that Elizabeth Ann, Jim's mother, was of presidential blood, claiming she had an affair with the late president, something she paid for. Everybody trashed her. Jim said his grandma Nan grew up down the street from Harding. He was even friends with Nan's father. As a young woman, she worked in his Senate office. And sometime later, the two connected on a romantic level. She gave birth to Jim's mother, Elizabeth Ann. He gave child support to her until he died. And it was, it was delivered by his Secret Service agent. After his death, Jim said Grandma Nan wrote a tell-all book called The President's Daughter to Earn a Living for Her Child. However, Jim didn't know he might be the grandson of a president until he was 14, a secret his mom kept to protect him from the media. And I came home from school one day, and the front yard was covered with... Cameras. Jim said his mom and grandmother endured the ire of the Harding family for years, and there were claims they were liars. That until two sympathetic second cousins asked Jim to do a DNA test with Ancestry.com about eight months ago. There it was, all these years, and we finally had the answer. He says the test results are most important for his late grandma. She loved him to the day she died. I know that she's up there smiling right now, so she's... Uh, She's as happy as can be. This is what she would have wanted. She just wanted people to know that she never lied. Now, Jim Blessing says he has two brothers, so Harding actually has three heirs in his presidential family. He says some members of the Harding family still don't believe that test, but for the most part, folks are accepting it as proof. Back to you, Jeff.